Hey everybody, welcome back to Andrew's Channel International. My name is Andrew and today we play some Arts of Iron 4 with Stalin. In the last episode we managed to capture Berlin and now our wide run towards our new objectives uh, is about to start. Actually, what I want to do in this episode, I would really like to um, penetrate the north of Germany reach uh, the Netherlands and Belgium and, and actually also aim to Paris. So while my troops in the south are keeping just our enemy busy, um, we do the, the best what we can in the north. As you can see, the defenses in the north are minimal now. And it's only 19th of June 1942, so the Americans are still not so uh, prepared for the war. They are already in the war because they're against Japan, but I'm not expecting anytime soon to see the D-Day, so let's see. In the north, what happened, <clears throat> which I didn't realize in the last episode, but I'm realizing right now, is that the German troops actually managed to uh, push and break the lines in, uh, in Finland. On the other end, I believe that it's going to be relatively easy to create um, a pocket here and I'm going to let me check if I can start deploying more troops because look at how many okay we don't have the equipment but look at how many uh, how much manpower we have here we're also preparing a, a government a collaboration uh, co collaboration collaboration is the government we can become spy master and get another spy so I'm not that concerned about here the north, even if I don't have any troop at all defending here, but I could always pick uh, some troops uh, from the front and just move south. Also leaving Turkey so um, uh, uh, free, it's a risk, but if the Italian disembark their troops here, we will create a pocket and kill them. So I consider it like a trap. It happened already in our gameplay that the Germans tried uh, another invasion in Riga and, you know, you all know how it ended, right? So, I hope that you guys are doing well. I hope that you are having a pleasant day or evening, whatever. And let's get started. Alright. Even with the tanks, uh, uh, we try to get an over and Bremen. Oh! Look at this! This is absolutely something that should not happen because I was supposed to create the <laughs> I was supposed to create the the pocket and not the other way around. Man, they kind of they tricked us. Okay, worked, it worked fine. Okay, and we might have another pocket here. Not really okay, let's stop. Yeah, we have the troops coming. They're pushing into uh, Eve again, but let's see. All right. I could lower my, my line here or just... Uh, just try something different. I, I have to think there. I have to think there. Okay, I have some tanks. I'm going to use them in Norway. Vasilevsky is perfect for the role. And what I'm going to do, I put Vasilevsky here. I cut. Then I kill them later. Move, move, move. Let me check the air. Okay. Well, I assigned all my airplanes to the generals but I don't have a lot of I don't have a lot of uh, guys here that could help potentially okay I mean I, I th think that I think that we can uh, uh, we all agree that I I should delete those. All 
right? I said to close the pockets that I have done here. And we lost Leipzig. Which is a disgrace, but we are going to, um, to win it again. Oh, medium tank. I guess it's time to create a new one. Improved high velocity cannon. Let me get this one and then we build uh, our new generation tank. Very good. Perfect. Perfect. Look at this. Look at this bullshit. I mean, what, what the fuck is going on here? What the hell is going on here, guys? And look at this. I, that, that's so ridiculous. That's so ridiculous. We have some pockets that... Uh, this is ridiculous. They're kind of penetrating in the in our territory, but... <laughs> They're funny. They're funny guys. I think I need to give just uh, just uh, an order to everybody. This is what I need to do. So this is what I meant. Okay. So now those five tanks are just. Uh, instructed to take back all this territory i don't care how but they will have to do it and uh, our uh, fallback line is back in place so we, we we get rid of the issue by the way having five damn five divisions in in murmansk it's uh, it's just it's just ridiculous isn't it what do you think let me see if timoshenko can just yeah better Adjust himself. Good. This is done, and probably we'll bring back some more tanks later. And you see, those guys have zero, zero um, supply. Perfect. Okay, let me see who are those guys, Vatutin, Vatutin, Vatutin. Right, Vatutin has too many people that right now have no... Um... Nothing to do, so Vatutin is now moving and pushing in this direction. This looks much better. Uh, I'm missing infantry equipment and I'm not building enough uh, infantry equipment. So what I'm going to do now, I'm using my giant industry to start building a lot of military factories and, and I will assign them then uh, to rifles. In the meantime, we are now reaching Bremen. Dresden is back in our uh, under control. And here we didn't manage yet to do this uh, damn... Uh, look at this. <clears throat> this is ridiculous, isn't it? I 
I removed to leave uh, the railway guns so that so I can bombard and have a complete advantage. Okay, we are in Bremen, Willemshafen. So uh, we, we got back the momentum and now we're pushing. We have Hanover and, and Germany is losing even more and more and more industry. So I tell those guys to go to Paris <laughs> by walking, you know. All right, so I will have to reassign all the lines after this operation. But what I'm doing now, I'm, I'm creating another two pockets and make sure that this counteroffensive ends very bad. As we made sure that this counteroffensive is uh, uh, now uh, over very soon. Right? Then we take a slot in the artillery, which is important. We take a new operational person. A spy, <laughs> also known as, as a spy, the operational person. We move him to Italy. Okay. When is the collaboration going? 28th of September, right? We, we need another, another month or two. And now we can take uh, Patriarch Sergi, uh, which is cool. I don't have yet the lessons of war for real. Oh no. I could try to get the control of Scandinavia. I'm looking what, what I could do now to get some bonus. Well, I, I could support Stalin. More stability. Great commander. Okay. Use forward. Division recovery rate plus seven. Victory is a 10 plus speed and plus attack. The motherland calls. So now we have three agit prop uh, policies that are giving us even more strength. And with this. Um, I don't need the infrastructure anymore. I take the Patriarch, which is giving me more stability, recovery, and compliance. Which is pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. By the way, let's close this. This is what we do. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what about you? What is he do? What is he doing? Okay. We are in Amsterdam almost. We're almost in the Netherlands. Uh, so Meritsov, he needs a fortress buster, uh, but also maybe a new line uh, let's say that merits of uh, stays here in the center and pushes slightly into the south okay shit who was captured? No, no one was captured. Pretty good. We're starting getting to Nuremberg, my friends. Let's go to Munich, my city. Augsburg, mighty Ulm, Stuttgart. And honestly speaking, guys, uh, let's move to Paris. Here I have the tanks that can push. And the Vichy Republic entered the war. So now, that's what I was waiting for. Oh, they didn't declare war yet. But they will try to invade. All right, maybe they're busy. Maybe they're too busy. Maybe the Brits will kick them. Otherwise, they will invade me in, in, um, in Turkey. And I will need to 
and we need to, to do something about that. But it's fine. Okay, so those tanks cleaned the situation in Finland. By the way, for military factories, we move on 60 uh, rifles because now we need them. So you go here. We are good. Perfect, we are good. So those tanks, those tanks could potentially lead the conquest of uh, Vienna and Bratislava, which are two capitals. So let's move the guys here in the south. And now we are in a war against Vichy France. And I don't have any any sort of infantry. And I'm actually 11,000 rifles under. I can ask the Americans maybe to give me a hand. Let's see. Let's see if the Americans are kind enough. Oh yeah. Look at this. M1 Garand. They gave us their old rifles, but that's fine. Zabrücken. Right, when the tanks are here, they need to push into Vienna. Okay. Faithful servant, and what should I do here? I need to carry more propaganda campaign. Okay, that's fine. We'll do it. We'll do it. And okay, then I move back to the industry. I develop Tankograd. Okay, develop Tankograd. <laughs> Whatever it is. What the heck? I have zero convoys. Zero. I never produced convoys. Did they, they kill all my convoys? And I'm so silly that I, I let this happen. Needed 30. In stock by 230. So I don't get this. I don't, I don't get this, guys. Trucks needed 2,400. In stock by 2,399. Okay. Train needed 570. Yeah, we have a zero because we have to import those American rifles and we, we, we don't manage. That's the reason. That's why we have a zero there. Stick, but no. But no is an important city. <laughs> Seriously. What the actual fuck? Free France. So we managed to, to capitulate Germany because what kicked in, my friends, was the collaboration of government. But what happened is that um, Belgium, the Netherlands, and France uh, became free suddenly. So I think that I won't be able to occupy. It. I, I wanted to. I wanted to say to uh, to to make them free. Yeah, sure. Now, um, since the situation is extremely chaotic here on, on this uh, um, border, I leave those guys where they are, sure. But those guys are moving into the, the next step, which is they need to conquer Italy. To stop. Okay, Rosakowski uh, might uh, now do a little trick um, in Hungary. No, 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 not this way. In, even if Hungary is not a major, but uh, he can push massively here. Okay, and this guy is gonna do something extremely stupid. No, not really. No, that's fine. I thought that I would push through the Alps, but I, I avoided. Uh, let's let's do this. Good. Let's move as fast as we can. Look at the factories. Jesus. We have an amount of factories with that that is 
seriously crazy. Okay. Right, so... Uh, oh, we don't have any more the desperate measures, alright. So we can uh, start Lesson of War. But I see that the Italians don't have any troop here on the border, so... I think that we can start already invading Italy, get, uh, go to Bolzano, Bozen, Trento, Verona, Brescia, Milano. And the others can go to Venice and uh, to the south and to direction Bologna and then Roma. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's such a disaster for the Axis. Let's get also to Torino and Genova. We really need those cities, they're very important. And this region, guys, is where you have the best food in Italy. Never forget. Okay, Slovakia... Um, Slovakia capitulated. Okay, that's pretty good. We have Budapest. Novi Sad is the next one. Hungary capitulated. What's, what's left? Well, actually, I need to check the non miners, so Italy. Italy's alone. Mussolini has been deposed and we conquered Rome. It's done, guys. It's done. It's done. They, they have no. no uh, there's no hope for Italy anymore. What's the capital now? Palermo? Uh, Luxembourg? What the hell? Oh, come on, for real. Are you real, Germany? So let me close this ugly border gore stuff so that I can then focus all those guys against Germany. Because they are trying to get back, you know. They're trying to say the boys are back, but the boys are not back. No, no, give me, give me this stuff, they're too fast. Let's see. Alright, guys, uh, Italy has capitulated and now Bulgaria and Vichy France are, are the new major powers. Okay, that's, that's fine. We take Shaposnikov. Where is it? My dear friend, it's time to push, push, push. And who's this guy? Popov. I think they did, no they did nothing during the war. I think so. It's time to push as well. And that's it. Now, what is the next one? Oh, because also wish. <laughs> now you see what happened. All right. Obviously, we need to move, move some troops here on the border again, right? Okay, Vasile. Uh, so, Rostokovsky. Rokozovsky, whatever, you go here. And you start pushing towards Vichy. You also go here and do the same. You go here and do the same. That should be enough. Yeah, it seems that Vichy capitulated and they, they were not able to... That's fine. Uh, 
Yeah, but you remember this was... What the hell is going on here? Why, why those guys are... My dear friend. We have a new mission now. You? Ubisoft. Ubisoft can go on this border and try to do whatever it happens. Yeah, it seems that in Yugoslavia we still have some some issues, but uh, Bulgaria is now losing it. Okay. Belgium has capitulated. Uh, Fine, I would I say, I would say. Bulgaria is really, really hooked. Yeah, and now we can move everybody on the French border. First we close. I mean, we have, a, we, we have an issue. There's still some... Do you see something here going on, but... So we fix this. Okay, let's build a new tank. Shall we? I didn't do yet the... the uh... Wow. Let's build a new tank. So we take the advanced medium tank chassis. We take a preset, which is the T-44. And then we take... Uh, what is this? Uh, a module slot, a medium one, right? Improved high velocity cannon. Okay. Hmm. Oh, but this is it. Let's keep it as it is. Radio 2 is the one. Uh, smoke launcher or defense, no way. I want to keep the square bore adapter, which is giving more piercing, and I want to also have another special module that gives more reliability. And that's it. And now we start producing T44 instead of T34. That's it, my friends. I need to, I need to start importing more tanks and though otherwise I would never be able. But I do it uh, from people that I share a border with. Otherwise, well, well I, I don't I don't share a border with them, but whatever. Stop this! I don't need this anymore. What I need now is a huge amount of civilian factories everywhere. So you can import even more uh, resources. And I think that I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna stop here, and probably in the next episode we see the end of the Second World War with the capitulation of the Axis. Uh, even if we still miss uh, uh, Japan, but we will take care about about Japan later. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.